Greetings everyone, Solofan Dancer 98 back at it again with the next of the Dragon Ball Z Bridge Reaction. We are going to get into episode 37 today, and apparently, if I remember right, Jiro just, uh, wait, was it? Yeah, Jiro, we want to find out this episode, I think. Uh, uh, we read it, yeah, Jiro himself is the android, so he flew the coop after 19 was destroyed yeah, last episode, and Vegeta is apparently Super Saiyan now. From pure, uh, what was it? I think he said pure... Oh, no, no, he said it was more than one way to realize the legend. I wanna, I wanna be a Super Saiyan! <laughs> yeah. Alright, let's get into it and see how they do. And I love how apparently Bean Daddy's reading this one. The following is a non-profit fan-based parody. Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, and Dragon Ball GT are all owned by Funimation, Toei Animation, Fuji TV, and Akira Toriyama. Please support the official release. <laughs> When a goddamn Super Saiyan asks you for a sensu bean pod, man, you say how many? <laughs> you know, I wouldn't argue with him given how he can blow up the entire world. Ah, oh, that's better. Count yourselves lucky to be in the presence of a shining golden god such as myself. You ain't a Super Saiyan now, god yet. You'll excuse me. I'm off to go kill the other android. You peons may stay here and erect a statue in my honor. <laughs> I like the sub quote. Does. Oh! The Aryans are more than happy to- oh, wait... <laughs> oh! Vegeta's a Super Saiyan! Yeah, whatever. Did you catch the name of his attack, though? I know, right? Big Bang Attack? Uh, I don't know, this is coming from Mr. Special Beam Cannon? Accurate. <laughs> hey, why don't you try coming up with a better name for an attack? How about... Devil Drill Beam? What about mm. Spiral Death Beam? Eh. Doom laser, rail beam, mm -mm. nail gun. Shit, that's good. That is good. <laughs> and a little copyright. So just because he's a machine, I can't feel his energy. That doesn't make any sense. Energy sense is bullshit. <laughs> hey, why are you hiding? You scared because I blew up your friend? I call it your sex bot, but as you're currently demonstrating, you don't have any balls. Also accurate. Oh, there he is. Yes, he's desperate to find me. I just have to wait him out. Oh, man. Sure do feel winded after blowing up your robosexual life, partner. Sure would suck if you jumped me and took my energy. Oh, no! Some dust in my eyes! This is the worst! Get the f*** out here! I was gonna say, someone get this man an Oscar, because that was... Peak performance. Hey, Vegeta! We finally caught up and oh god, no! Oh god, yes. There we go. And now your energy is mine! But that's exactly what I was planning on. I knew you couldn't resist jumping out to suckle on my Super Saiyan teeth. And now you're mine. All mine, you old lady! Hey, get back here! I wasn't done! I see, he hasn't fixed that habit of monologuing yet. <laughs> this tactical shit's getting really old! Now you get out here and fight me blindly like a man! <clears throat> Mandroid! Yes, you may be a super saiyan, Vegeta, but you're still just an arrogant little brat, aren't you? No, Are you the oxen, bitch? <laughs> Well, while you continue to prattle on, I shall make my escape and... Oh, they followed me. Mm -hmm. No matter. I'll just head the other way and... Mm. Okay, fine. I'll just maneuver back where I came from. Why the hell is he even here? <laughs> then again, at my age, I could use more greens in my diet. Uh-oh. Alright, what about Regicide Blaster? Doomsday Crush, Anarchy Barrage, Taco Tuesday, Hellzone Grenade, and yes. screw you, I'm keeping that one. Agreed. Uh-oh. Hello there. <laughs> I'm gonna leave you two alone for now. <laughs> oh, don't struggle. Just lie back and think of Namek. Oh, boy. Damn it. I have to contact Gohan. Gohan, do you hear me? Oh god, this feels amazing. First thing I'm gonna do when I get home is step in front of a full-length mirror, strip down, 
Turn Super Saiyan and <laughs> bring cat it. love food. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cat love. Uh, you heard nothing. Damn it! Gohan, this old man's got me from behind. You have to. Oh my! Seriously, how do people keep getting on this line? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Go on. How did you? You two are hanging in the middle of the air. How can I not see you? Accurate. <laughs> How would you expect to not be seen at that point? Don't you sass me? Well, look, well, that's a great way to do this. Yeah. Well, uh, this is a little awkward. Maybe. We could have a little dialogue and work this out. Uh, no. Okay. Then how about I fight the bold one first? Anytime, old man. No, that one. Mm. Yeah, I'm opt out. How about this one? Oh, please. As if you're in any condition to fight me. Krillin, sensor bean. Sensor bean? Sensor bean. Sensor bean! It's gonna become a running gag these last few episodes. open your metal ass. Yeah, how about you just leave the one-liners to me? Yeah. Besides, the old man is mine, Namekian. I just figured you wouldn't want to sully your Super Saiyan hands on such a weak opponent. You know, the funny thing is, I know you're playing me, but you're right. He's all yours. Ah, yes. Pick me against your little green man. I've already consumed enough energy from him to match him twice. <laughs> 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 Jimmy's just like, ha! Oh my ha! god, Chaozu's dead! And he really let himself go! Ah. Uh, and he's an android. That's not Chaozu. Dude, but we never did find out what gave him the psionic powers and everything, so we don't know if he is or isn't an android at that point. Origin of Chaozu theory, someone get on that. Oh, crap baskets. <laughs> There's a long pack. list of bad ideas, and this one is at the top. You know that, right? I absolutely refuse to sit around and not be part of the action anymore. Do you know I never even saw Frieza? Not once. I'm pretty sure no one ever complained about not meeting Hitler. I mean, some people do, but they're weird. This isn't up for debate. You do know your kid is in the plane, right? Oh, he doesn't know what's going on. Yeah, I don't think that's the point. Also, he keeps trying to feed up. Is that Mr. Roboto playing in the background? <laughs> Of me. Don't worry, he'll give it up when he realizes it's a dry well. Yeah, about that. Have you ever seen what an old sensu bean diet does to a man? What? Corn likes it. <laughs> I'm sorry, I need a moment to process that. Okay. Apparently Yajirobe can produce bean milk. Bean daddy's becoming even more of a bean daddy, apparently. <laughs> Keep him away from me. Okay, first. What? Second? The f You know, I did okay. spend three years training with Goku. Oh, so what? Are you a Super Saiyan now, too? Yeah. Well, more of a Super Namekian, I guess. Foreshadowing. I thought you were a demon. Nope. Slug man. Wow. That's... Significantly more mundane. Uh, I know. <laughs> By the way, what's that brain case made out of? Oh, well, it's a polycarbonate thermoplastic laminated. <laughs> Anyone else feel like we overtrained for this? Tell me about it. No, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Krillin forgets his place. We need to put him back in the place. Mr. Piccolo! Oh, never mind. Mm -hmm. Why you would even bother installing pain receptors? Kind of comes off as an intentional design flaw, if you ask me. Well. Don't you criticize my methods like you understand the neural system? Pain is imperative to recognize when you are in peril, to give the human mind context. So contextually speaking, how f are you? Blind, <laughs> colored son of a bitch! It's going to take me at least two hours to program a new hand. No, wait. 
I'm right-handed. Three hours! You miserable reprobates! What have I ever done to you? Pretty sure you vaporized half a city. I meant recently! That was an hour ago. Yeah. Semantics! <laughs> I'm sorry I'm late. Semantic. The time machine's a little imprecise in terms of hours, and what the hell is that thing? Trunks? What are you doing here? Ha! That's a girl's name. Wait, isn't that the name of your kid? What, are you trying to imply that this wannabe super saint from the future is my son? <laughs> well, I guess that cat's out of the bag. But seriously, what is that? Is he still going, uh, trying to process that? Jeez, it runs out the Lego movie with Emma, just like, I'm gonna have to report you. Lucy? Ooh. Ooh. I'm gonna go now. That's the android. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. <laughs> yes, I am. You stay out of this. <laughs> Wait, so you're saying that that's not the android that kills us? No, I don't even... But you said two androids, right? And we've been fighting, too. Yes, I said two, but that's not one of them. Why didn't you tell us what they looked like, then? I only ever met the two. Well, look at that. So did we. <laughs> hey, guys. And now the woman's here. Oh, no. Did she bring me? And there's my door. Uh. Well, shoot. Wow. Windscar. But Spirit. Okay, so Windscar is Inuyasha. Spirit Gun, Yu Yu Hakusho. Bunkai. Bleach. Resengan. Naruto. Gum -gum pistol. One Piece. That sounds dirty. <laughs> Accurate. <laughs> oh my god, technically it is, given how he's literally... I had to bring it up. Oh, I didn't think about it till then. Oh, my years reading One Piece gone to waste. Yeah, I gave up once I got to the Toy Island arc. It just wasn't fun at that point anymore. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed that. I'm looking forward to seeing more of this. Cause, oh my god, the reference is here. Anyway, like I said before, looking forward to seeing what episode 38 brings, and oh my god, Belmore, really? You, this is what happens when you try and join the action, and you have your power level of, like, 7. Max. <laughs> oh my gosh, Chef Ross, he is weaker than Hercule, but... Tangle's so stronger than the farmer, even though she has technically been able to have been trained in gun usage, so, you know, there's that. Anyway, looking forward to seeing what happens next, because now we now know that at Android... Also, known as Dr. Dro, if you've read the manga, um, isn't the real androids that are supposed to come later. They are the ones who replace him as the true threat. Uh, many people speculate about, like, is it because it was timeline, butterfly effect, whatever. I, th I think it's just because, you know, originally I think it was in the Trunks Pass, I think they did beat Dro 19, but. They didn't realize that there was another pair of androids, and thus they were unprepared and separated in order to not fight them efficiently like they were here. So, there's that. Meantime, looking forward to seeing what they do, because I'm starting to remember more and more, because now I'm starting to agree with some of what they were saying. So, it is coming back to me. I think after episode 40 is when I'll have clear memories, because those are the more recent ones, from 40 to 60, I believe. All the Cell vs. series, that's going to be fun to get to. Anyway, you guys take care. I'll see you in the next episode. Bye!